Today, I'll be creating two players to break every NFL defensive record. I'll be making a cornerback and a defensive end to break the records for most interceptions and sacks. And it's not going to be easy. For example, Ray Lewis has the most tackles in a career with over 2,000. And Paul Cross has the most interceptions in a career with 81. Pulling this off in Madden is going to take a miracle. But if you're subscribed to the channel, you know that's what we do. So let's start with cornerback records. Look at this graphic. This single game interception record is 4. It's a lot of interceptions in one game. Uh, the single season record is 14. And then for a career, is 81. And for a defensive end slash linebacker, the most sacks in the game was 7. The most sacks in a season was 24. And in a career was 200. It's a lot of sacks. Pause. And then we'll also go for the tackle record. So single game tackle record is 20. Most in a season is 156, led by Ray Lewis. And then most in a career is 2059 also led by Ray Lewis. So I decided to make a 99 overall cornerback and put him on the Detroit Lions. Dula Sanders, you know, maxed out stats. And then on the Ravens, I made a defensive end, Dula Watt, 99 overall right end. I wanted to put them on separate teams. That way the different defensive, you know, schemes and playbooks don't uh, conflict with each other. And I also put them on contenders, the li my lines, by the way, in the Ravens, really good teams. So we're gonna track both of their careers throughout this entire video. And hopefully by the end of this video, break every record. I want y'all to comment down below who do you think the best NFL defensive player of all time is is it Aaron Donald is it Deion Sanders is it Ray Lewis it might be Aaron Donald or Ray Lewis but let's start by looking at Dula Watt I made him a beast six foot eight as you can tell 311 pounds and I finally figured out how to give rookies x-factor abilities you guys in the comments have been cooking me for not knowing how to do it but real quick looking at his stats I literally made everything 99 for both for both players except I guess impact blocking and for his abilities that were automatically given to him we have unstoppable force as his x-factor ability then we have inside stuff secure tackler speedster and run stopper and then for my boy Dula Sanders we got the bottleneck x-factor ability then we have inside shade persistent flat zone ko and then acrobat which will help us get some acrobatic interceptions now i was gonna make a linebacker as well but i felt like you know making a right end will get the tackles and sacks a higher chance instead of a linebacker so for my cornerback i'm gonna be running the base 4-3 defensive scheme it's actually it's a 100 scheme fit and uh, it has four defensive linemen three linebackers ideal for generating a pass rush and allowing seven defenders to drop into coverage and hoping i get more picks off of that and then for my defensive end on the ravens the defensive playbook i'm going with you know after looking at reddit was the buffalo bills apparently they had the best one for getting sacks it's a 4-3 scheme focused on generating pressure on the qb which is what i'm looking for and it's going to be a 46 defense which is a 95 percent scheme fit so i think for both players what we'll do we'll just simulate to uh the playoffs in our rookie season and we're gonna see what player is gonna you know come closer we're gonna probably do 15 years of simming it's gonna be a long uh, journey to track both players i'm really bad at multitasking and managing two things at once so hopefully i don't get too distracted i'll try to you know make it organized well the ravens got a lot better 15 and 2 is actually insane and we had the number one defense in the league uh and and and, and then we Wait, hold on hold on how many points allowed we were first only 210 points allowed so who had the most sacks it will be Dula Watt with 31 and a half QB sacks in a season that's wild and that breaks the record of 24 so we already broke one record in a season uh with 31 which is great and then tackles in a season we ended up getting not the most it was a middle linebacker that got the most but we ended up finishing with how many it was 88 tackles. The record is 156. So if anything, uh, this dude almost came close, Cody Barton. And interceptions, please tell me it's my guy. No, it's not. Hold on. Where's Dula Sanders at? Yo, ah, uh, I don't see myself anywhere. There we go. We only had three interceptions this season as a rookie. That's it's pretty bad. The record is 14. So we're like 11 behind. That's it's not good at all. The cool thing is we already make the record of the NFL record book as a rookie, which is unheard of, by the way. And the most sacks we got in the game this season was six, as you could tell right here. So we're very close to breaking that record. I mean, the record is seven. So I feel like in one of these years, we're going to get it. You know, Derek Thomas, Chiefs legend. He got it in real life. That's my guy. But of course, we have the first round by for having a 15 and two record. And then the Lions are third in the, uh, I'm so bad. With, I think they're in the NFC. I'm really bad with, like, with the NBA, I know conferences, like, the back of my back of my head right here. But, like, for NFL uh, is way more confusing for some reason. Even, like, the divisions. I'm, I must be, like, a casual. But I'm just saying, we're up against the Buccaneers. We should end up beating them. So we'll just simulate to next week. I mean, ideally, we have a Super Bowl matchup of the Ravens versus Lions, a battle of the defenses. I think that'd be kind of hard. Uh, we're up against the Chiefs, though. Not going to be an easy uh, task over there. 
and the Lions ended up winning 24 to 17 against the Buccaneers. Uh, how, did, how did that go? I got an interception. I got an interception in a playoff game and then four tackles. That's a W. And I feel like because we have two players in this video, I'm just going to hop into the Super Bowl. We have two times the chance to make the Super Bowl. Um, so I will just hop in Super Bowl games. We end up beating the Chiefs and we're up against the Bills, which is going to be, a, a, I mean, not the worst matchup in the world. We ended up getting blown out, the Lions, by the 49ers, 38 to 24. Makes sense. The 49ers on paper are amazing. Brock Purdy threw for 247 yards and McCaffrey ran for 93. So if we win this game, we're up against either the Seahawks or the 49ers. If you want an easy chip, I want to go up against the Seahawks. No, we end up losing 21 to 20. What? And it's going to be the 49ers winning the Super Bowl. Dak Prescott wins MVP. And Dula Watt wins Defensive Player of the Year and Defensive Rookie of the Year. So we got one of them winning it. I want both of the guys to, you know, end up winning Defensive Player of the Year. But off to a great start. I'm not going to lie. I think for the, for the defensive end, we're going to break that record. I'm more concerned about the cornerback. Now, this is a preseason game starting year number two. And it's the battle of the best def defenders in the league. I'm not going to hop in. But looking at the defenses compared 85 to 84, I do want to see uh, the actual lineup how it looks. I know in real life, the Lions defense, it needs some work. Like, we could really use some help on defense. The Ravens defense, though, is insane. We already have Roquan Smith, one of the best linebackers in the league. We got uh, Marlon Humphrey, one of the best cornerbacks, and Kyle Hamilton. We got, you know, yours truly, Dula Wap. Let's look, let's look at the Lions defense. Lions defense is very, is not very impressive. We have Aiden Hutchinson. So uh, yeah, that's why I didn't add, you know, the best uh, defensive lineman on this team because we already have Hutchinson. I don't want it to be a, you know, a conflict of interest to them splitting stats. CJ Gardner Johnson is the only other redeemable person. You got Branch as well, but for the most part, this defense is not very good. But I have a feeling one of these teams are going to make the Super Bowl, so we're going to have some gameplay this season. We better. Hey, if y'all play uh, high school football, college football, middle school football even, I want y'all to send your clips to me on Instagram, and I want to see like if y'all can actually you know play for real. And if you do play defense, a cornerback, or defense end, what's your personal record for like the best stats? Like, I wonder how good are y'all? I know a lot of people play high school football, so I want to see, you know, do y'all really, are y'all really like good at ball? I didn't play. I felt like if I played, I'd be one of the best defensive linemen in the nation. You know, 5'8", 170 pounds. You're not stopping me. I'm getting 10 sacks a game. I am so disappointed in my Detroit Lions going 8-9, and nine, missing the playoffs. That's, that's There's actually no excuse that the Lions missed the playoffs, bro. We have Jared Goff still. We have David Montgomery, Jameer Gibbs, our wide receiver court, 99. We have the best receiver in the league in Mustang Brown. And we signed Amari Cooper. And you're telling me we, come on, dog. And the Ravens finished as a six seed. That's also pathetic. What's going on, chat? God dang. 39 and a half sacks this season for Dula Watt. Bro, 39 and a half is unbelievable. Actually unbelievable. 87 tackles. Yeah, I probably should have made a linebacker to get the tackles, dog, because we're not going to get it. Uh, the, Demario Davis, shout out to Demario Davis, you know, former Jets player, Fred Warner. No, uh, they, they can't even break the single season record. You know, Ray Lewis is, is got, you know, dominant of his own player, but... The 39 and a half is nuts. Bro, the record was what, 22? Yeah, tw 24, 24. <laughs> Bro, almost doubled it. And the interceptions, ah, ah, we didn't, I mean, we got five. That's definitely an increase, but like the top guy got eight. So in these Madden Sims, it's very, very hard to be, uh, you know, get over 10 interceptions, but it's what it is, man. Oh, I have an idea, by the way. I, I just thought of an idea. I'm going to let y'all know later in the video what I'm going to do, but it's going to be genius. Just just watch. Just watch. All right, by the way, we lost 31 to 17 in the, in the first round, so... Another wasted season. Sucks. And it ends up being the 49ers going back to back, man. This is this is nuts. This is nuts. And yo, the first time I've ever seen this happen in Madden history. A defensive player wins the NFL MVP. Has that ever happened in the NFL history? I doubt it. Matter of fact, Siri. Uh, do you know? Alan Page did it back in 1971. Nah, I don't even count. Bro. Yo, we just made history. We unintentionally made history. I didn't even think we win MVP. But yeah, we win MVP and Defensive Player of the Year. That's that's very, very insane. Yeah, this guy is off to an insane career. So our third season, and look at all the 99 overall players. Obviously, it's us two. And then we got Sauce Gardner in the mix. Shout out to Sauce Gardner, bro. He went to uh, Cass Tech, I believe, which is like, bro, 10 minutes away from me. So shout out to Sauce Gardner. We got Patrick. Uh, I'm very certain that's his. That was. I'm sorry. That was that was very corny. Wow. Um, Certain. Um, I was trying to do it like a joke about him being certain that he's, and then we got Michael Parsons, nine out, look at all the, bro, 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 why is there so many nine out overall players? There's Henning Malik, Oprah, 
right? I'm a little concerned that our record is 11 and six. Uh, we have an 81 overall offense. I have a very bad feeling that Lamar Jackson left us. No, he's still on the team. What? Hold on, hold on, hold on. If our QB is Lamar Jackson, okay, running back sucks. Wide receiver wise, we got Zay Flowers. Tight end, Mark Andrews still. Am I bugging or am I bugging? Like middle linebacker, Roquan Smith. Um, Ojabo out of Michigan, he still hasn't panned out, which is weird. And then, I, I don't know why we're not, I don't know why we're low overall. I really don't. Are my Lions in here? No, another season of the Lions missing the playoffs. That that really sucks. It's not like playoff stats uh, count towards the record anyway, but like I still want to, you know, have that Super Bowl matchup. Once again, another great season for Dula. We got, th er, they're both Dulas, but uh, for the defensive end, 34 and a half sacks. So what, in three seasons, that's already about 100 sacks. The, the career record is, the career record is 200. So what I'm thinking is this, once I break the career record for sacks, I'm gonna switch him to a linebacker and try to get the tackles record because I mean he still has 89 tackles. Um, I think we, we we could pull it off. So if he does two for one, that'd be insane. Yo, we only got two picks. I, I, I don't think there's anything I can do about it. But enough simulating. I want to actually hop in a game and get sacks, you know, and control them. I love using the defensive end of Madden and getting user sacks. We beat the Patriots. Now we're up against the Browns. I'm a, I'm a. I'm gonna hop, I'm hop into this game. We're using this 6 8 menace himself right here. I'm just gonna straight bull rush him. Ah, hold on. Let's go. I missed a tackle. Nice. Nice. Low key, I should have made him like seven foot, like the max height. I, I feel like 6 8 though is big enough. I don't think, I think that makes him the biggest defensive player ever. They gotta start double teaming me. Good uh, hit stick right there. Bro, and I'm pretty sure that uh, Aaron Donald is six foot. So this guy being six eight is nuts. I got the tackle right there. And it's fourth and inches. They're gonna punt it. Come on, come on, come on. Get on, big sack, baby, that's on me. And we're subbed out for this play. Third and six, come out. Other guys come out big. Yes, he broke the pass up. Fourth and six. All right, hey. I'm only controlling defense. I'm gonna stay true to it. Lamar Jackson, please. Oh my God, we still couldn't score. We could have put up nothing. So we gotta get it. Maybe a forced fumble sack or something. Off that end, come on. Come on, you gotta get through him. Interception. Ah. This right here, low key, determines the game. If we don't get a stop here, we're cooked. We're there though. Look at that speed. Woo -hoo -hoo! I wanted to force a fumble, man, and pick it up and score a touchdown because our offense can't. Come on, dog. If I can't, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I, I, I'll i do myself, bro. I'll do my damn self. Punt return touchdown. This offense sucks. I had to do it myself on the punt return. Uh, and I'm going to hop back on defense anyway. Can we get a game-winning stop right here? They have all their timeouts. So they still have plenty of time. And it's really up to us. How bad do we want it? Get him! I do for my life. No! No, get him! Get him! Damn it! No! Get him! Damn! <gasps> What? I could have swore I had it. I could have swore I had it. No, 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 no. I could have swore I had it. Instant replay that. Uh, there is no way. I set the pressure. I was, I was right there. Look how close I was. Oh, I touched him. I literally touched him. He got the ball off clean. And, and, and that might have just cost us the game. Bro, please. No, we lost. That's it's scripted, dog. It's got to be scripted. We lost off some BS, man. Hey, ain't no way Lamar Jackson won MVP. After that playoff performance, there's no way he should have won MVP that season. Hey, I'm not gonna lie to you, low key, I might just say bump it and trade the cornerback to the Ravens. I, I might as well. Uh, actually, actually, better yet, we might trade the, the defensive end to the Lions because this team got worse. I feel like Lamar Jackson either killed himself or he left the team. Uh, no, he's still on the team. All right, well, Dula's leaving. Or Watt's leaving. Okay, so year number four, and we have the Doulas on the same team. We got Watt and Sanders on the same team in uh, the Aiden Hutchinson situation, because he was our original right end. I ended up making him a right outside linebacker, and I took the uh, the Ravens defensive scheme that we used, the 46 defense and Bills defensive playbook, and I put it on this Lions team. So our defense is insane, right? The best cornerback, the best defensive end, the best linebacker, basically, or one of the best. Um, even free safety is now CJ Gardner Johnson. Very solid and our strong safety as well. So we have an 89 overall defense, but there's an issue. Our offense is trash, dog. We don't have a good quarterback. We have Jameer Gibbs at a 90, right? Uh, uh, St. Brown's wide receiver, solid. Tight end Laporta, solid. Uh, Penis uh, Sewell, Pan Pan Sewell, really solid. But our quarterback is our only weak spot, but he's a rookie. So hopefully over time, he'll develop. At the end of the day, this video is about defensive stats, not offense, so we're chilling. I mean, the more time on the field for our defense, the more stats we can get. So low key, I kind of want to 
you know, be bad on offense. I feel like the the, the New York Giants back in the in the mid 2000s, right? Hey man, look, hey, game is game. 11 and six, you know, not the best, not the worst. 91 overall team though. I think we are the best team on paper. We have to be, obviously. We are like what 499 overall players. Uh, but I have high expectations, man. Defensively, ooh, okay. 27 QB sacks, a significant fall off from what we had before. Very, very interesting. Um, and then interception wise, uh, okay, well, we got four. So that's, okay, that's cool, that's cool, that's cool. We ended up crushing the Rams 35 to 17. So let's see if we can keep it going. Beat this Buccaneers team. And if we win this game, I will hop into our next one. We lost 29 to 12, dog. It's our QB issue. This offseason, our main focus is getting a quarterback. But at the end of the day, we lost to the Super Bowl champs. Apparently, uh, Tua led his team to a, to a chip. Good for him. Look what we have here. We can get Anthony Richardson from the Indianapolis Colts. We're just trading away basically our entire future. But it's all good. Finally, thank God, man. 13 and 4. I was, this is more, re honestly, we really should have went 17 and 0. But like 13 and 4 is, is, is I'll, I'll take it. We got a first round bye. But now the fun part. Moment of truth, man. Let's start by most interceptions. Let's see who led the league in that. That's Trent McDuffie with only six. And yo, what? Oh, Aiden Hutchinson left us. So that's actually a good thing. So probably more room for, uh, you know, the, uh, my DN to, to really get sacks. But yo, what the heck, man? Yeah, that sucks. I, I, that's kind of why I did this video combining the cornerback and DN because I knew if I did a separate video on cornerbacks, it wouldn't really pan out like I wanted to. Um, as you can see, did we get any interceptions? Bro, I don't think we got any. Oh, man, I'm falling off, bro. Or Michael Parsons just cut 28 and a half for Michael Parsons. We got 28. Yo, I don't think we, we have, I, we, I don't think we get topped at any season. So the Tennessee Titans, not only do they have uh, Michael Parsons, but they have Jeffrey Simmons at right end, who got six. And then Aiden Hutchinson at right outside linebacker, who got four picks, 85 tech. Bro, yo, the Titans might be one of the better defenses in the league i mean the cool news for us is that we're like one or two seasons away from breaking the all-time sack record and then we can convert them to a linebacker to get the tackle record but i mean damn okay so we beat the eagles in uh the divisional game so we're up against the giants man so starting off we end up putting up a touchdown on the board let's see cpu defense all right 14-3 i'm only gonna hop in if it's a close one 45 to three. Yo, we are absolutely dominating them. I don't, I don't know how we beat them that badly. I got two sacks interception wise. Uh, we won't talk about it. So here we go. This is this is game of the video right here, in my opinion. The Super Bowl against the Kansas City Chiefs, 15 and two. They still have a peak Patrick Mahomes. Now, to be honest, I want to set the tone early. So we're hopping in and at, the, at the beginning, at the beginning of this game, we're going to hop in. What the? What is my stuttering issue? Am I actually like retarded? Like, what was wrong? What I was trying to say is I'm trying to set the tone early, so that's why I'm hopping in in the beginning of the game, and I'm gonna try to get some sacks. Oh my God! I ran right through him. <laughs> that's how you get in his head early. Third and 17. One more time. One more time. They got a double team. They're getting me. They're getting me. And hold on. That's the first down. What a what a what a play. What a play. I'm really bad at controlling the cornerback. I feel like I'm on an island all by myself. Stay with them. Okay, we're good. And jump that. <laughs> to Jeff Akuda. That's not Jeff Akuda. I think that's Gardner Johnson. That's a pick six, though. That's all me. Horrible pass. And we convert. Defense putting up points right away. All right, that's Devin Bush. That is not. Oh, that's, that's Devin Bush. My God. So that puts us right back on defense. I'm going to be user in this area right here. He's going to throw it. Oh, I wanted to get there in time, but we forced the breakup. That's it. I'm, I'm a beast. Let's go all in. All in. Rip right through. Rip right through. I'm going to send all out blitz right here. I have finesse move as well. So let me use my finesse move. Spin around. Yes, sir. Get to him. Hey, fourth and 20. Jack Campbell with the sack. Damn, I'm going to hop in, bro. Our offense sucks. Third and four. I'm going to assume he's going to pass it. So I'm just going to man press right here. Uh, can I throw him off? Hold on to him. Yep. Perfect. Perfect. He still got that off in traffic, bro. Let's try this again. Get that side. Yup. We're good. Oh, good sack, baby. That would be fantastic. So that's what I'm going for. Get right through him. Get that sack. Dive at him. Yes, sir, baby. From the edge. From the edge. Come on, man. Who with a breakup. Fourth and eight. They got a punt. So moment of truth. Can we score? Oh, my, I'm back on defense? What? What happened? We threw a pick or something? Oh, nah. We lose like that. We must have threw a pick or something right away. That is so ass. <laughs> we just lost the Super Bowl like that. 
Dula Watt had five sacks. Uh, my other cornerback, he had three tackles. Tough, tough. We lost in the Super Bowl, bro. And for the first time in the video, Micah Parsons takes my defensive player of the year. We got to get it back. All right, cool. We finished 12 and 5. Wild card. We can skip it. Uh, the good news is, I think we finally crossed one of our other records. We go to NFL records in a career. We go to defensive sacks. Yes, sir. Dula Watt is there. 216 sacks and we the record is 200 so we already beat that record in a season we had the most sacks in a game i don't think we ended up beating that record um but yeah this season i think we had 27 yeah we had 27 in 2020 there yeah, we're 29 i hit 27 um in a game is he still at that same one yeah we cannot cross that one but the thing is, we have some more stuff we're gonna do with him. Pause. Because tackle wise, we only have 631. We need over 2,000. So I'm gonna switch him to a linebacker next season uh, so we can cross that record. And then in terms of interceptions in a career, so far, uh, Dula Sanders only has 20 after playing six years. We need 80. So we're not on pace. We gotta have a miracle happen. And the Dolphins end up winning the Super Bowl. Lamar Jackson's actually the MVP of that team. He's on the Dolphins now, so good for him. He wins the ring before us. It's now time we officially change him to uh, middle linebacker. I feel like middle linebacker has the highest chance to get tackles. Uh, Ray Lewis was a middle linebacker, fun fact. Fred Warner went earlier in the video when he was there. So, and he has the mind reader X factor. Hold on, low key, I gotta get hit. What is it? I mean, he could probably read minds, I'm imagining. The best defenders are capable of dismantling an offense like they knew the play call the whole time. Oh, like uh, he could read, like a mind reader. Yeah, okay. Okay, okay, okay. All right, cool, 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 cool. So we have the no outsiders, strip club specialist, pick artist, and run stopper. Yeah, big season. I want to break the single season record of tackles, which is 156. So our first year linebacker, let's see what we can do. Moment of truth. Ah, oh, nah, we weren't, yo, we're nowhere to be. We're not even close, bro. Yo, yo, we're not even close, dog. Ah, uh, only 108 tackles. I think it's because of our defensive scheme. I gotta change it next season, but damn, that's, that's a lot. Bro, we had that many tackles as a, as, a, as a end, but it's all good because we are here in the Super Bowl, back at it against the Jacksonville Jaguars this time. We have yet to win one. This could be our chance, so let's do it. So being a middle linebacker is gonna be a bit different. I can actually lurk the field and try to get uh, interceptions or just play the middle. Whoa, 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 whoa. And then of course we can't forget, I still got my quarterback wherever I'm at. Where am I at? There I am. Okay, on, on, on the man offense right here. Zone, oh, I got beat, I got beat. I got beat, I got so lucky. Hold on. Damn, I missed. Oh, big tackle. I'm going to go back to using the big guy right here. I think I should just blitz him, right? I think I'm going to blitz. I'm gonna, Oh, I got blocked. Dang it. No, get him. Damn. Third and five. This is it. Lurk that middle. I'm there. I'm there. Damn. He, he, that, was, that was a dot. How did he? Bro. I hope they run it. Because if they run it, I'm going to boom him. I'm going to boom. I'm going to. Hold on. Ah, he jumped in for a touchdown. We're cooked. Let's see. Is our offense going to score? Mm, yes, we are still alive. We still have hope, man. All right, so we forced to stop on defense. On offense, we scored, and here we go. So it's 28 to 28. This is it. They have three timeouts. We have two. 40 seconds left. Can our defense clutch up and send it to overtime? Use ring man defense. Oh, I could have picked that. Second and 10. Play my zone. Play my zone. Ah, okay. Playing my zone. I'm good. Oh, he got me. He cooked me. He dropped it. <laughs> we got so lucky. If they get a first down here, we're cooked. Our best bet is to, uh, I mean, I don't know. We got to get a pick or something. We got to get a pick. Can I get a pick? Can I? Can I? No. Oh, what? First and 10. They could just hand it off. Can we force a fumble? Something? Not, nah, we're cooked. They're gonna go for a field goal though. They called a timeout and they're going for a field goal with 14 seconds left. They kind of gave us plenty of time and I did ice him as well. So actually I didn't ice him. Well, uh, we ended up losing. It doesn't matter at the end of the day, 31 to 28. So we're 0 for three in Super Bowls. Hate to see it, man. All right, so fast forward and both players have now played 13 or 14 NFL seasons after this one. And usually with my experience, they retire after 14 seasons. And then once they retire, you can't see their stats. So I'm, I'm catching it before it even happens. So career defensive interceptions, do I see my guy? No, unfortunately we couldn't. Defensive sacks, we finished first all time with 238. You already know we did it in the season. Um, and then in a game, uh, we didn't, but for interceptions, I don't think anyone came close. Let me see. Defensive interceptions. 
Yeah, no one in this era could do it. But looking at career stats, we finished with only 1,500 tackles, which is 500 short of the all-time record. We couldn't do that. Uh, you know, Dula Sanders with 1,000 tackles and only 35 interceptions. So unfortunately, we could only break two records, which was the sacks for a season and sacks for a career. Everything else we couldn't. It was really, really tough. But hey, we tried it and uh, we kind of passed, kind of failed. Game is game. I'll catch you guys soon, man. Peace.